Hey farm hands, farm boy Reef here. So on today's episode, we're going to talk about the magnesium uh, sulfur test kit. I want to bring you guys in close and personal. We're going to do some tests together. I want to show you guys how easy it is and all the instructions. So come on in guys, let's check this out. All right gang, so here we go. Let's test this magnesium. So what you need to do is you have to take your two milliliter syringe, as you guys can see here, and you got to move this piston to the two mil mark. So we grab our sample water right here. And then we're just going to make sure you tap all the air bubbles out of it and then move this piston to the two mil mark. So you just put your excess uh, water back in your sample. Good to go. No more air bubbles. We put that into our sample vial. So we put that one to the side. So what we're going to do now is we're going to take the MG1 and we're going to add five drops, but we'll just shake that up a little bit and make sure everything's mixed. So we're going to add five drops to our test sample. So one, two, three, four, five. All right, and we're gonna put that one to the side and we're gonna mix this for 30 seconds. So one, two, three, five, four. six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. All right, so now we got that one in there. So what you need to do now is you gotta take the MG2 and you gotta take the little red spoon that comes with it and just fill it up level. So we'll open that up and make sure it's level so you guys can see it's perfectly level. You're going to put that into your into your test file just like that and then you're going to put that to the side. Now we got to shake this one for 10 seconds. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. All right, so that's good to go. So what we're going to do now is you're going to take uh, your one mil uh, syringe with the tip on it and what we're going to do is we're going to move this piston all the way to the top and then we'll push it down so the piston's going to end up on the, the one mil mark. So what we need to do is take uh, the MG3, open that up, and then we're going to place the whole syringe in here and then we're just going to suck up piston all the way to the top so you guys can see. And then you're going to move this piston all the way down to the one mil mark. So you guys can see here the one mil. So there's this little bit of air, but this air is made up because of this tip because the tip here has the same amount of uh, liquid that this should be in this area. So you always move your piston there, you'll be good to go. So let's put this to the side so we don't knock it over. What we're gonna do is we're gonna keep adding drops um, to this uh, sample test here until it turns either gray or blue first. And then whatever turns first is your, your reading. So just keep adding drops and shaking it as you go. I like doing it over a white piece of paper because you can actually see the colors better. Just keep mixing. Keep mixing, just adding as you go. So we're looking for uh, gray or blue, whatever one's come first. A few more drops will be right there. All right. So we're blue, you guys can see that? So that is our test. So what we need to do now is we're gonna, you go, if you look here, you put, go forward and each one's a mil. So you're gonna look, so right now I'm at 10. So this 10 here and I go over onto my chart over here. So you take your 10, take your reading wherever your piston is and we're look. So we look here for 10, we're at 1350. So my magnesium is uh, is right on in my tank. So that's even perfect. So that is how you test magnesium. All right, gang. So that's how we tested the sulfur magnesium. Hopefully that made it really easy for you. Also, thanks for uh, tuning in guys. You guys could please subscribe and hit the like button.